سول ايش Can you guys hear it? Beautiful people, it's not a yet. If you don't know, it's the Nyonga Nation. Hey guys, uh, <laughs> when last did I speak to you guys? Was um, Tuesday when I was in, on the drive to get here. Um, I've seen seen some of my figures in my videos so far we've posted about um, six videos hey guys this area I'm living at where my aunt lives there's a lot of Indians so I think today they're celebrating I don't know what I'll try and put it at the bottom so yeah there's a lot of Indians around in this area so Definitely, you guys can hear this. But yeah, um, the last time I spoke to you guys was last week, Tuesday, when I was in the bus showing you the area and stuff. Oh, I know my thing is growing. I need to definitely this week. I need to go and check this. hear about that but yeah I was trying to say the last time I spoke to you guys was Tuesday and today it's a Sunday Sunday the 6th yeah, the 6th so yeah my videos have gone up already there's about six videos today it's gonna be the sixth one that's gonna be going up they are picking up um, views just not as I hoped but I'm definitely not gonna lash um, more I'm just gonna continue um, because the videos have been already scheduled so definitely you guys are going to be watching those videos so yeah um, I hope you guys enjoy them I'm just gonna put a few clips when I got here but I didn't take a video of my luggage because my luggage broke on the day of me leaving Ikaya. Um, but yeah, other than that, we're good. I just have been chilling at my aunt's place. I didn't want to do much. I wanted to like take a break and just, I haven't even like spoken to my family. Um, only just today. Um, I, I laid, I am what what do you call it I isolated myself so from a lot of things I didn't even go to the beach I really wanted to go to the beach when I was here but you know what the other thing I just wanted to do was to be with my aunt um, yeah as she's going through the whole grieving process and stuff so I just wanted to spend time with her and never mind me not going to the beach but it's fine I know water is calling me in a way, but on this trip, I just wanted to like spend is But other than that, I really have enjoyed my time being around here. As you can see, there's a lot of green in Kazanin in the back of my um, background. There's a lot of green also in this house as well. So yeah, I guess green does 
tend to bring in new life so obviously you can breathe fresh air so yeah I'm grateful which I did make the trip to come down to KZN because I know I definitely needed it um, the city sometimes can tend to be a bit crowdy and um, overwhelming at times you do need to like get away find an escape so I guess my escape is coming home <laughs> in KZN so yeah I'm up but I really really did enjoy coming back here um, but yeah thank god they are but yeah I'm um, really enjoying my time here um, my mom was just asking me earlier hey you just kept quiet not speaking to us I was like I am isolating I'm taking my time I just wanted to be in the present moment and not be disturbed because also with my phone I haven't been way too much on my phone because I wanted to actually just be out of it and not be on social media or anything yes my videos are going up on YouTube but I am not actually doing the things that need to be done on YouTube and stuff um, there's some stuff where I posted like I could get views because I've seen some of my other videos are not getting too much uh, traffic but yeah other than that I haven't been really on my phone I have been reading <sighs> this traumatic book this one here I have been continuing reading this I am close to finishing it because I'm on 163 page, page 163. So I have been reading this book every night. Yeah, I've been basically reading this book every night before I sleep. And yeah, man, it's just, I thank God that I came up across this book, honestly. Um, it has revealed a lot of things um, which I have said it does tend to bring up some traumatic um, events that has happened to me when I was still young and that I'm currently dealing with um, yeah man just this book had got me thinking about a lot of things um, I thank God which I came across it because I even spoke about my battle when I was a kid being called names and all those things and being raised different from other kids and yeah just yeah the whole journey of this woman that I am right now it just has made me like really reflect on it um, yeah Is these things that are falling on the tree <laughs> they're making a noise so yeah um, I'm not gonna bash this book shim it is really for women who battle with both women because she speaks about Ooh, Eva she talks about Eve and then she also speaks about Mary so she also talks about how uh, Mary and Eva are both in, in, both women are both inside of each and every woman. I hope that makes sense because that's what she, she says on the book. She says we all have an Eve and Mary in, in each and every one of us as women. So, yeah. She talked about the journey that Eva had. Um, and she also talks about how she got to understand how Eva was how she yes she committed that sin that she was not supposed to do she was warned by God by the shepherd so and then everything just plays out in her life and then Mary comes along 
and then yeah <laughs> I don't want to go too much into details about the book I don't want to spoil it for people but I would say if you're going through some traumatic um, events that have happened in your life I would say read this book it really does help that you dive into your childhood traumas and stuff and get to uncover and unpack what really happened to you when you were young or whenever that trauma had happened to you and you get to like um, dissect everything that you've gone through and you get to uncover what really happened and what made you into this present person that you are so I would say definitely read this book and yeah you're gonna shed some tears you're gonna get angry you're gonna get triggered but I would say definitely read this book and get to enjoy it um, yeah but don't bet on my word but read the book um, yeah just you get to unpack a lot so yeah as a woman I would really 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 recommend this book um, yeah <laughs> but anyways yeah other than that other than that um, there's nothing much happening I just wanted to like catch up with you guys and tell you that I'm okay I am not dead I am not what else yeah I'm not dead I'm just I have just zoomed out of the the space of social media and stuff so I just wanted to like breathe take everything in and yeah get back to myself get back to my regular self but yeah I hope you guys are blessed and highly favored. I hope you guys have a lovely, lovely week. Um, I know this video is going to be going up next month because this whole month is going to be my 30 days challenge. So yeah, from my heart to yours, I hope you guys have a splendid and beautiful week. Yeah, and stay safe. Bye guys. Bye. <laughs>